30 theme park guests are riding more rides this 4th of July with short wait times, even for some of the most popular attractions. News 6's Troy Campbell joins us live now in Troy. Sounds like they picked the right day to go there. Right, it's all about how you look at it. Eric, we all know that the 4th of July holiday, it's typically one of the busiest days of the summer for the theme parks. But this afternoon, if you pulled out your cell phone and you looked at their apps that show their wait times, a lot of those wait times were shorter than many expected. Well, that's not what I'd expect for, uh, for wait times to be down on a holiday, but I'd say that's... That's a good thing, obviously. Ricardo Ochoa is visiting Orlando with his family from Texas. He says while hitting up the theme parks this week, they've seen their share of long lines. But the wait times on what's typically a busy 4th of July, tourists like Ochoa say that's a good thing. That'd give you the satisfaction of knowing that you got to see everything. Trey Griffin is here from Denver, and he says he was at Walt Disney World this morning, something he says is key to avoid the longer lines. Crowds are really, I mean, in the mornings, the crowds are real low, but then as we got throughout the day, it really got a lot busier, I would say. At about 3.30 this afternoon, over at Disney's Hollywood Studios, the wait for Toy Story Mania was 45 minutes, and the Twilight Zone Tower of Terror, 35 minutes on this 4th of July. Over at Universal, we caught wait times as low as 15 minutes for Harry Potter and the Forbidden Journey, and just 10 minutes for The Revenge of the Mummy at about 1 in the afternoon. Ceci Trevino went to Disney yesterday instead, now questioning her decision. Maybe, yes, today should have been a day, but we we had a ball game that we uh, wanted to attend. Now, Disney insiders do say that both Epcot and Magic Kingdom should get extremely busy a little later on tonight because of their added firework display. Eric? Makes sense. People shifted their plans today to see those fireworks. Troy, live at Disney, thank you.